Hi there world, I'm Travis Ruskis, I'm an artist, and this is Question the Creative. So thanks for those of you that submitted your questions for the first episode. I'm out here, it's about 4.45 on January 23rd, this is San Francisco. So the first question we have is by Angelica. What made you start doing what you do with the rocks? Your first artistic time doing it. The first time I did it, you know, I was in the creek. I went and I, after 45 minutes of me just like thinking and thinking and thinking, I was able to just stop and really be present and really feel the environment and feel the stone and feel the weight of it. And it finally balanced in that one point where it just it seemed to be suspended, but I knew that I did that and that it was real. And as I stepped back, it was like it's something that was completely free and something that I made. And it was just, it was the coolest feeling ever. And from that moment on, I was hooked. Kayla asks, can we design freedom? I think that freedom is something that is, um, it's, it's a natural element that surrounds us. It's like the stones. It's like the water. Um, it's just so abundantly there that <laughs> it's, it's almost funny because we want to like, like America is the only free country or like countries try and politically get freedom, but actually it's abundant. It's something that we all share and it's a universal law. What happens though is that we create these societies where someone can be jailed or controlled or manipulated so that they don't have freedom. And what we design is rules for them to somehow follow and then unlock freedom. I feel that freedom should be free to everybody. And I think as once we start to connect as a whole, as an entire globe, then we can start caring about each other on a much deeper anonymous level. It's not about where you're from or who you are. Just the fact that you're there should be unconditional love. Uh, Ape Dog asks, do you wear steel-toed boots? Actually, Ape Dog, I do not. Uh, I never had a rock. No, I take it back. I've had, I've had a rock crush my toe one time. Uh, but. It's still toed it when you're walking you can't really like you don't have that flexibility when you're walking i like to really kind of like feel my environment so i just wear just normal shoes so thanks for your question Dave dog aaron asks as an artist there are times when i feel uninspired true that if this happens to you what brings back the inspiration or the fire within that is a great question Aaron, and i'm sure there's a lot of other artists out there that feel the same way um, I myself am constantly in a battle with this of feeling like I'm not good enough or like I don't have the right fire or whatever but ultimately what really brings me to create some cool stuff is just going out and creating to it's so hard to explain because it's something that you really have to feel for yourself but it's like do what you love and if you're finding that you're doing something and you're not putting your energy into it or it's becoming so time consuming and through the end of that you're just not able to see the reward in it then shift to something else if you're an artist maybe you want to shift to something new i used to be doing a lot of uh, i was heavy into abstract painting and it was only until that i started to do stone balance that i was able to really connect with myself as an artist but also with a bunch of other people and help them in a way that um, really abstract painting couldn't do so it's not to say that what you're doing isn't great but maybe you might want to try and do something new or just really do it for you if you're finding that you're doing it for somebody else like I'm done I'm not doing the stone balance stuff because of you I'm doing it because I want to do it I would love to bring you into my world and share with you the process and my thoughts and everything about it but ultimately if YouTube didn't exist or if the internet didn't exist I would still be out here connecting with the stone so I hope that answers your question that that's probably a good way to end it it's actually too windy today for me to go and balance and there's no rocks in this specific location so um, I'm 
really kind of bummed out, but I wanted to do something uh, for you guys and give you some, some great content. So if you have any more questions for me, I would love to answer them. And you can go as deep as you want or as shallow as you want. I would just love to answer your thoughts. And that way we can make this a two-way street so it's not just you looking at me, we're actually having a little conversation. So in the comments below, ask me your question. You can find me on any social network and use the hashtag question the creative. So thank you for watching and have a great day.